guys, Ivan here, and this is the all new Mercedes Benz EQS. And here we can see the edition one in two tone paint. This car looks really, really futuristic, as you can see here, with the tail lamps and unique front end. This is in AMG line as well. And in this video, we are going to take a look how this car looks from the exterior, interior, and also during drive. And you will know all important details for this all new electric. EQS. So when you go closer to the car, the doors will open automatically and you can close them automatically as well. As you can see here in the video, you have a lot of new sounds in the EQS. When you are entering the vehicle, starting the vehicle and starting to drive. So whole new sound experience is present in the EQS. So now let's take a look at the exterior shortly and then we are going to take a look how this car looks during drive. So the EQS is very close relative to the new S-Class but it is built on the brand new all-electric architecture and because of that we have all new design available one bone lines and cap forward design with fast back as you can see here the sloping roof is really prominent in the back of the car and this car looks extremely futuristic, as you can see here on the video. This car is finished in two-tone in Edition 1, but of course this will be available also as a single paint option. So here we can see the unique AMG line wheels, unique for the EQ versions of the Mercedes-Benz, and the whole new fascia for the front, as you can see AMG line bumper, but the brand new is the black panel unit, instead of the traditional grille. At the rear we can find the LED strap which connects the rear tail lamps. And these are brand new, very unique in 3D helix design. So brand new design for the tail lamps. So let me know what you think about this all new tail lamp design. So now let's take a look how this car looks during drive in motion and talk about this brand new EQS. So depending on the size of the battery and the vehicle equipment and configuration, the WLTP range up to 770 kilometers and that's 481 miles according to European norm. So this modular drive concept allows a wide range of maximum total drive powers from 245 to 385 kilowatts and performance version with up to 560 kilowatts is being planned. On request, the EQS has four automatic comfort doors, which open automatically with key fob or from the MBUX system or with the help of the door handles. A new technology digital light has a light module with three extremely powerful LEDs in each headlamp, 1.3 million micromirrors, so together 2.6 million pixels per vehicle and very unique branding EQS Edition 1. So now let's talk about which versions will be available from the start for this EQS. So there will be two versions EQS 450 Plus and EQS 580 Formatic. So the 450 Plus will be the real wheel drive system and 580 Formatic the all wheel drive system. So the 450 Plus will have max powertrain output 245 kilowatts, that's 333 horsepower, and 568 newton meters of torque, that's 432 pound-feet of torque. The acceleration from 0 to 100 kilometers per hour or 62 miles per hour is in 6.2 seconds. And the top speed is 210 kilometers per hour or 131 miles per hour. The battery capacity is 107.8 kilowatt hours and this car will have fast charging 200 kilowatts so from 10 to 80 percent it will charge in only 31 minutes and in 31 minutes you will get up to 300 kilometers of range charged and that's 187 miles. So the rear-wheel drive model will have electric powertrain EATS at the rear axle and formatic version will have one more electric motor at the front axle, so two motors. So the EQS 580 formatic will be much faster than the 450 plus. So the power will be 385 kilowatts, that's 523 horsepower. The torque will be 855 newton meters. 
and that's 630 pound feet of torque. An acceleration from 0 to 100 km per hour or 62 miles per hour will happen in only 4.3 seconds. And the top speed is the same in both versions, so 210 km per hour or 131 miles per hour. The charging time at the wall box or at public charging station with AC charging 11 or 22 kilowatts, so with 11 kilowatts it will charge from 10 to 100% in 10 hours and at 22 kilowatts in 5 hours. So this should give you a great range for your everyday driving but also very fast rapid charging on the longer road trips. So these new 3D Helix design tail lamps have curved LED lights on the inside as you can see here. So in terms of the trims we will have standard equipment exterior, then AMG line exterior and electric art exterior. And the new EQS is the most aerodynamic production car in the world with new CD best value of 0 0.20 and the operating range in particular benefits from this. It also benefits in terms of the quiet ride from the wind noise and the very low wind noise level contributes significantly to the quiet ride. You will be also able to select the recuperation in different levels and the EQS marks launch of the new generation of batteries with significantly higher energy density. The black panel unit at the front has very distinctive face. The exclusive look of the black panel radiator grille with central Mercedes star can be enhanced with optional extra three-dimensional star pattern under this black panel unit. And this is available with AMG line exterior or electric art exterior. The EQS is the first Mercedes to offer the option of activating completely new vehicle functions via the over-air updates OTA in many functional areas. Available from the launch will be two special driving programs for young drivers and service staff, some little games and demo program the best or nothing. The standard rear axle steering with steering angle up to 4.5 degrees contributes to handy and dynamic impressions of the EQS, the same system as in new S-Class, but with upgrade over the air you can also purchase the 10 degree rear angle steering. And the MBUX hyperscreen is the highlight of the interior which merge multiple displays into one seamless band over 141 centimeters wide. The MBUX hyperscreen is curved in three dimensions in a molding process and for example when the passenger will be watching content on their passenger display and the driver will look at the display the passenger display will dim so the driver will be not distracted by the content of that display. Alright guys, so this is the first look and key elements of the new Mercedes-Benz EQS. Let me know what you think about this electric S-Class in the comment section down below. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you soon in the next video.